Hi everyone, this is Jackie from Keep It Simple Stickers and today we are back with another plan with me in my classic happy planner. We will be planning for the week of May 8th through May 14th and the kit that we're going to be using today is one that I recently hauled. I will list that down below in the description box from DEK Designs. This is her Mother's Day kit. Um, so let's go through it really quick. Uh, when I hauled it, I did show um, did show the pages, so I'm not going to spend too long on it. But I did want to, if you didn't see that haul, go through it. So here are your full boxes and your weekly. And this, this deco is beautiful. There's like a little girl with her mom, which I think is so cute. I have a little girl, so that was very special to me. You have your um, ombre checklists, a couple bildus, trackers, some stickers to... Um, be put across maybe appointments that have to be canceled or changed. You have nine half boxes. These, I don't think they're quite quarter. I feel like they might be a little bit bigger than quarter, but we'll see as we go along. Some scallops, skinny checklists, flags, miscellaneous pieces to mark things. Your bottom washi, date covers, date dots. And then this was an add-on that I purchased. You have your headers, um, some littles, some hydrate stickers, and some icons. All right, if you are interested in watching this plan with me featuring DEK Designs, then just keep on watching. All right, so we're going to start per usual with the washi, and this looks like, even though I purchased the Happy Planner um, version, this looks like it could be, could fit, I'm gonna have my Erin Condren right here, in Erin Condren. Yep, it looks like you'd have to go all the way to, the, can you all see that? You have to go all the way to the bottom to have it fit. So. Hers must be similar to mine in that um, you can use it for either. So that's cool. Um, and it looks like they're also the same length. So it's going to go all the way into the sidebar, which is also fine by me. So let's go ahead and get started. So this is um, Mother's Day week. I've, I've never used her kits, so I'm just trying to kind of see if I have to go. Yep, I'm going to have to go all the way to the coil. That's fine. Um, I've never used a kit by her. I never had ordered from her. So um, she was having a really good sale a few weeks ago. And she's actually not on Etsy. She's on her own. Ah! Oh, that came up nice, though. She's on her own um, website. So you have to, like, you know, create an account. And then, um, which was very easy, you know. There wasn't any issues with that, so... You know what, that's not straight on the bottom. Let's see if I can pull it up really quick. Um, I think these are just matte. I don't know if they're advertised as removable, but they, as you can see, they're coming up really nice. So that's cool. I'm going to go ahead and lay this down really quick, and I'll be right back because it might take me. <laughs> it might take me a couple minutes. Alright y'all, I'm back. I had to pull up the sticker so many stinking times, but I think that I got it. So let's go ahead and let's do the other one and we'll see if I fare if I fare any better on the left side. So how y'all doing today? I hope you're doing good. Um, currently it is Monday, May 1st when I'm filming this. So happy May to you all. Um, I know that you're probably not seeing this until the weekend, so um, I am currently participating in a group, another group sale. It's called the Planning Posse, I think it's, it's P-O-S-S-E, -S -S -E, so that's Posse, right? Yeah. Um, so I'll go ahead and leave the code somewhere on the screen. I don't know it yet because it is so far in advance, but um, I'm sure that if you follow me on Instagram, which I'll also link below, that you will um, have heard about that. All right, so because this washi has gone up into the boxes, we're gonna have to be a little creative. So um, this current week, I did a no Etsy kit. I didn't film this, but um, I really, really like how it turned out. However, some of the stickers that I used, my pen, which I normally use, I don't know if I brought it in here, a Paper Me ink gel. Um, they were skipping on it, so I went ahead and I used my Sharpie Ultra Fine, but wherever there isn't a sticker, um, it kind of bled through to this side, if you can see that. So I'm going to have to definitely put some boxes to cover at least this one on Tuesday, and I'm just going to have to 
make a mental note that this can't be used directly on paper, um, even though it is really smooth. So I'm um, thinking of my placement um, of stickers. This one that I did, um, I did film this one from just planning around. I put them on the bottom, which is what I normally do in this planner, but I think I wanna maybe scatter them this week. So let's do that. Let's start with here and we'll put a sticker there. I want to save the girl for actual Mother's Day. So let's start with the birds and we'll put that on Tuesday just to kind of, I don't want to say get it out of the way, but if that's distracting you, I'm sorry. We'll just go ahead and we'll um, lay these down. So I think they are removable. I'm pretty sure they are. So, which is nice because you know, I have a hard time placing stickers down straight. <laughs> All right, so again, we're gonna have to be creative. I'm kind of, I think that I might leave this open and do my, my littles and stuff there. So let's go ahead and we'll put one there. This one is beautiful with the pink flowers. They're coming up off the page really nice and smooth. Um, her prices are very, very reasonable. I wanna say this kit, before I added on this, I think it was only $8. So I feel like that's really a really good price for stickers. Let's do this one Wednesday. And you know what? I said I wanted to kind of make it random. So let's do that. Let's make it random. Um, yeah, I stumbled, I think one of her PR girls on Instagram, that's how I found her. So um, there you go. PR girls do definitely help out. Um, as a lot of you know, I am a shop owner myself. Um, my shop is called Keep It Simple Stickers, like you heard in my intro. And um, I have been, um, I had a lot, quite a few people contact me about being um, a PR girl for me. Let's see, let's do just right here next to it. I'll keep it kind of random. And um, I definitely have considered it, but between being a mom and a wife, which are my two main priorities always, um, and then teaching part-time throughout the week, and then I do, you know, I just finished, um, actually right now I'm finishing up my second job, which is seasonal. Um, I just am very busy and I haven't been able to, and doing YouTube and, you know, all that, trying to grow my small business, I haven't been able to set up PR um, people say girls because perhaps there's males out there that are interested all right and let's put this one up here oh I love this one I'm not normally into um, like people uh, in my stickers I know is that odd um, I know a lot of people are but, like they're into that those you know wispy thin girls which is totally you know if that's your jam that's you know that's your jam um, but it's really not mine um, but I really liked this one. I felt like it was, it wasn't like dominating the page and I really liked the other designs. So I think it's really cute. And then of course, I'm really close to my mom and I have a daughter myself, as you heard me mention in my intro. She's about, she'll be 15 months tomorrow. She was born on Groundhog's Day of 2016. So it's kind of fun. Um, so I definitely, this kit, I wanted to get a Mother's Day kit and I had not created my own for my own shop. So when I saw this one, I love the colors and um, the design. So I just had to pick it up and I'm really pleased because it is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. All right, so we got our today headers on. We got all our full boxes down. That's great. So let's go ahead and let's put our checklists in. And I like that these are all the same. You just have the, the girl with her mom scattered throughout the page. So it's gonna be really easy to, to place these. So anyways, I was talking about uh, PR girls, wasn't I? Um, or people. So I think over the summer, to make a long story short, because y'all know how much I like to, to chat. Um, I think I'm going to do it over the summer. So that's my plan because I'll of course be off from my teaching job and um, I'll have time to, to devote to that. Um, so I think it'll be, if, if you watch me uh, here on YouTube and you also follow me on Instagram, definitely keep a lookout for that. It will be like, a, um, 
just over the summer, you know, probably like 90 days trial period, just because um, I just don't know how it's gonna go. I wanna, you know, I'd love to say that it would work, but um, I'm just, you know, I'm hesitant. I'm hesitant to throw my hat in there. So, all right, enough of that jibber jabber. Let's get these to-dos on there and then we'll do some pre-planning and I'll be right back. Right, we're back. We've got all the headers and a lot of the main structure done. So let's go ahead and let's do some pre-planning down here. So I don't have too much space and that's fine. I'm not, you know, really worried about it. Um, I do want to put though a hydrate tracker. Um, one of my goals for April, if you watched my just planning around plan with me, was that I wanted to drink more water. And I definitely think that I drank more water but not nearly enough each day. So um, I wanna keep that going. And I really like that these are included in the kit, so I might as well use them, right? And they are just com coming off the page and going down beautifully. Like they are a perfect, perfect fit, which is, which is really nice. So there's like no overhang, there's no, it's really nice, I like it. Love it. All right, so we got those hydrates down, and so we're gonna go ahead and also put a meal down for each day because I am a big meal planner. So we'll do that. However, my meals, you know, it's kind of up in the air sometimes depending on my schedule and my husband's schedule exactly like what I plan for, but I do meal plan every day for dinners. I don't do, um, I don't do breakfasts or lunch. I don't meal plan that yet. However, I have considered it. I just, it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work to meal plan um, for dinners. So I think about doing that for lunches too is kind of ugh. So she doesn't, she didn't have an additional pink one. She had an additional lighter green one. So that's fine. Um, Fridays, we do have a show. Mm -hmm. We watch RuPaul's Drag Race, my husband and I do. And then Sunday, I also watch another TLC show that I just started yesterday. And y'all, I can't believe I'm telling you this. It's that Breaking Amish show. Let me let me check my, let me check my lighting. There we go. It's that Breaking Amish show. And I just, I get sucked into those shows, y'all. I know. I can't, can't even handle it. All right, so I'm sure you're like, Jackie, we don't care. Um, let's see, what else do I have on here? So there's a phone call one, an asterisk, um, and then we've got a lot of icons in various colors, which is lovely. I, really, I love that she has an Amazon one. That's a lot of fun. Um, so I'm going to use a couple of these for my bills. So I'm going to use the phone call ones, I think, because um, she does have actually a couple bills here. So let's use... I kind of, because of space issues, I think I might hold off on those and still use these. So she's got a money bag and like a check and a credit card. So all of those could definitely work for bills. So on Tuesday, we're going to put the dog walker one in. And like I said, yeah, we're going to use the phone call because I don't think I'm going to. Oh, wait. Tuesday's green. Put that back. So that's our dog walker bill. And then Wednesday is our daycare provider bill. So I'm going to keep stacking before I put the icon down just so that I don't have to lift it up. And let me just take a peek here this week if there's anything else. Nope, I think that's okay for littles. Um, so let's see. I guess I could use these headers on top if I wanted to, but I don't think I am. 
um, I'm just gonna go ahead and move to half boxes so Monday I want to use a half box for that group of students that I tell you all about all the time um, so I like have a specific lesson that I use and you know what I noticed that she does not include washi which is fine I'm not worried about that I just want to make sure that I have um, because see, I'm going to need like a little tiny piece right there. However, this pink does kind of match. Um, so I, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and use the little. Put that on top just so that I have a no white space. So I do like to plan for that group of students. <laughs> let's go ahead and lay that down. And let's see if there's an icon for that. I don't think so. So I'm going to have to get into my binder once I'm done with the structure and see. Um, Tuesday the 9th, I don't think anything's going on, so I'm just gonna put a I'm just gonna put a half box. Let's see. And then if anything comes up, I'll write it in. And I think because I had um, three littles there, it seems to um, take up that space so I don't need to use that header. So let's see, um, I wanted, told you I wanted to use an icon. So let's use for our dog walker, let's just use the credit card, even though we don't, we don't pay with our credit card, but um, actually no, I wanna save this icon for um, the blue. Let's see if there's, there's a money bag in the lighter green, so we'll use that. Um, all right, so Wednesday, we'll go ahead and we'll use another half box because the 10th, we don't have anything going on. And then I'll go ahead and lay this down for our daycare provider. Um, Thursday my uh, is my brother-in-law and sister-in-law's anniversary. So I want to mark that somehow. I think I want to use maybe one of these. Well, I like that little heart. Hmm, we're gonna have to use a little header to take up that space. And I guess I could use the half box still, and then I can just write in their anniversary. And I'll use, let's see, this is the lighter pink. I'll use this heart flag, and I'll just put it in the corner like this, and then I'll just write in their anniversary. Um, oh, I need to backtrack, I'm sorry. On the 10th, my daughter is going with my father for daycare. Usually she goes Tuesday, Wednesday, but this week she's going Tuesday, Thursday. So we'll still pay our daycare provider on either Tuesday or Thursday, so I'm not gonna have to pull that up. But I wanna mark that she's going with my dad. So I think I'm gonna use this scallop here. And I'm just gonna put it within the checklist and I'll just make a note that she's going with my dad oh and that's not straight I'm really trying guys to make my um, sticker placement especially when I do these plan with me's more straight because I know I'm on a time crunch because my daughter is sleeping right now so I can't take like an hour to do this but I really just want it to be a little bit straighter um, if possible um, okay Friday nothing going on Friday so we'll just use a half box Friday is my big laundry day so I think um, I'm going to put um, the icon in the to-do part so I'll put the washing machine I'll just put it up here and then I'll write my list down Saturday um, oh Saturday I think we are planning on going to a nursery so, a nur like a, um, oh my gosh, I'm having a moment, I'm having a moment, uh, like nursery for plants. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Jackie, get yourself together. So let's use a little, and we'll use a half box again, and we'll use the pink because um, I want to mark that down that we'll be taking a little trip 
to a nice nursery that's uh, close to our house. It's not super close, but it is close. So I'll use the car and I'll put that there. And I think I'm, I have another sticker that I want to use from another um, shop. And then lastly, we're definitely going to be going to my parents' house for Mother's Day. So I want to put a half box in for that. And I don't know what we're doing yet, but we will be traveling. I don't think I'm going to put another car in there. I think I'm going to try and find um, a, um, a sticker to mark Mother's Day. And I think I actually have one from... DEK designs so that'll work out nicely all right cool so this is definitely um, you know no white space this week that's fine let's go ahead and let's put our date covers in so this is gonna be tricky because it looks like these are for um, Aaron Condren so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to use these which is kind of stinky but it's not the end of the world um, because they're just they're too narrow this is too wide um, so I think I might have to save these. Hmm, sad, because I don't have any washi either with this kit, except for these two little tiny pieces. Um, let's see if I have anything in my stash, and, um, I'll be right back. Maybe we can make something work. Okay, so I'm back, and unfortunately I don't have anything that could work with this. So, um, I'm just going to put these and save them for later. Um, no big deal because the pink does actually match pretty nicely so let's go ahead and let's do the sidebar and then we will finish up all right so sidebar let's see what I have left here um, I have some trackers which I'll definitely use and um, I do have one full box left so let's go ahead and let's use that and we're just gonna cover because as you can see I have a little bit of writing that bled over from um, last week, or rather this week, so let's fix that up. Yeah, and these definitely are removable. Removable mat. I don't know if they, she um, offers glossy. I think she does. I believe she does. Alright, let's see. That's better. Okay. Yeah, much better. And we're also going to use from that sheet um, Maybe not, maybe we won't use that. I have not decided yet. Um, okay, so usually on the sidebar, I have like just regular to-dos. Um, so I think that I wanna do that. So I know that I have some to-do headers that I can use um, because I used all of them, all of the pink ones here. So I'm going to pull this sheet. This is from Just Planning Around. It's her glitter headers. Um, and let's see if we can find one that kind of matches. I could always use the silver. I could always use the gold. Looking at the pink or maybe even like the yellow. Yeah, let's maybe do the yellow. So we'll use this yellow to do header. Actually, you know what? That looks a little too yellow. I'm going to put that back. I need something. Maybe this one up there. Let's try this one. Yeah, that's better. It's not a perfect match, y'all, but it'll work. And then, because I use all the checklists too, I'm going to use um, one of these. This is from With Love from KT. Um, she's one of my very first features. I think she actually was my first feature. So let's go ahead. I've got her neutral, and then I have her bright. So I think I'm gonna pull something from the neutral. Um, I probably could try maybe this camel color, match it up, or I could use this light pink. Let's just use the light pink. All right. Is that straight? That's straight. I don't know if. Um, Katie's stickers pull up easily though. I might have to just leave it. Let's see if I can. Oh, they do. They're not removable, Matt, but. They do come up okay. I keep checking my lighting because it started off very overcast here and it's gotten significantly better. So I keep checking my lighting. All right. Um, and then I think what I'm going to do in this section, I'm going to go back to my DEK designs 
and um, oh, you know what? She had a skinny. She had skinny ones. I could have used hers. Um, actually, no, I think I am. I'll put this back if it will stick. Save that for another time, and we'll use hers just to keep things kind of cohesive. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and use um, one of these instead of with love from KT. And let's see, let's use the what color? Maybe the lighter green. Yeah, let's use that. Very good. And then this, these last couple sections, I think I'm just going to use um, another half box from DEK Designs. And that will probably do it. That might be my goal for the week, or that might be um, my highlight for the week. So we'll just leave it like so. All right, so we have pretty much everything done. I did pull some stickers. Um, that I want to use from various other shops. So um, this first one is also from DEK Designs. So these are her kind of like wacky holidays. You can see I already used that. So I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to lay them down. So this is uh, May 8th is Women's Checkup Day, which is funny because I do need to make an appointment to get a checkup. So I'm going to go ahead and just lay this down in the full box. Um, Tuesday, May 9th is Teacher Appreciation Day. Actually, you know what? I could put these up up here. Nah, I think they're going to be a little too big, so we'll leave them in the full boxes. Which is nice because I am a teacher. Wednesday the 10th is Clean Your Room Day. Sweet mercy. My room is pretty clean, though. I mean, like, clutter-wise, it's pretty clean. The 11th the Eat What You Want Day, that's funny. That's funny, I like that. Uh, the 12th is Fibromyalgia myalgia Awareness Day. I hope I'm saying that right. I'm sorry if, I, if I'm not. The 13th, of course, <laughs> this is a funny one. Fruit Cocktail Day. And then the 14th is Mother's Day. So we'll put that right here. All right, very good. On the 8th, um, a friend at work is her birthday, so I'm going to use these stickers from Wish Upon a Sticker to mark that. Um, I think they're really cute, so I'll use the light pink, and they are glossy, and I'm going to put it in the checklist area, because I'll need to make sure that I um, send her a quick text um, to mark that we might be going to the nursery. This is from Just Planning Around, so... Um, this is one of her functional sheets. She's part of the um, planning posse as well. So I think for that, um, let's do the rain boot. We'll just put that in the corner. And then I'll write in that we went to there. I also have these stickers too that say today I planted. So I might save those for when we actually, my husband and I actually do some planting. Um, I noticed that there's no weekend banner in this, so I pulled these from Very Sweet Stickers. However, I think like this green one might be the best fit. Yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and use this um, weekend banner. And I'm gonna put it down here, kind of covering. I don't want to cover too much of the hydrate stickers. Let's see if I can get this straight. Good. That looks really nice. And then these are from Just Planning Around. They're the wash hair stickers. So I do like to mark when I wash my hair because it is quite a task. Um, so let's see. I think I'm going to do it on Tuesday. Let's see what color I could use. Maybe the green. over the weekend at some point as well. 
All right, I'm gonna take a peek back at my monthly and we'll see if I have pretty much everything done. Okay, so it looks like I got everything done. This is the finished spread. I hope that you all really enjoyed watching this plan with me from DEK Designs. Um, I just love how this turned out. Her stickers were beautiful. Um, very easy to work with and lay down. Um, so if you are interested in purchasing from her, I'll definitely link her um, shop website below for you to check out. Um, if you liked this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I would love that. And I'll catch y'all in my next video. Bye-bye.